I'm surprised he's not in here. Maybe he's lurking or something. They want the big D, baby. Oh no, they almost got bopped up here. He has a stunner. <laughs> That's too ugly. Should have been, that should have been a, a trade-off right there. That should have been a trade-off. Ooh. No! <laughs> ah. <laughs> Alright, or um my boy got this. I don't want to take his life because I feel like he can he can get one of y'all. He's good enough to get one of y'all out and then that's it. I believe I believe in um my boy. Plus I don't want to take his life and then only he only has like 80%. I'd rather him have his whole health. I mean, I know damage can get racked up pretty quickly, but everybody's at like a high percent, so they, they gotta be cautious. They can't just be running in on my guy like that. Okay, that's one now. See what I mean? If I would have came in, I probably would have got jumped, or I probably he probably would have died, and it would be DK versus these these little dudes, and they would have been stockpiling me, man. I'm glad I didn't take his life. Yeah, I know, right? <sighs> that was my first initial Resident Evil 3 gameplay. Now I have to replay the game sometime. You know? I die. <laughs> that worked. <laughs> and 
input. Oh, I could. I don't know how you tell who's who, man. It's so much shit going on. Oh, he's got Wolf in the place. Motherfuckers did that shit and synchronized. You saw that shit? Stab him in the ass. <laughs> Cut those frog legs off. That was funny. Joker. Am I a joke to you? That hit me. I was already. Oh, nice. Oh, my God. I've been trying to grab. Wait, where am I? I don't know how you guys keep up with this darkness. It's too dark. What? 
Japanese. I don't know what the fuck he said. <laughs> ah. How did I die though? I was like at the tip. I was on the edge of the level, man. That was a close one. Sorry about that, um, Ken. I can't, man. <laughs> I actually didn't even know that was me. Oh shit, here we go. Don't get hit by Arsene. Don't get hit by Arsene. Okay, he's gone. You got, you might have a chance. Oh shit, Ken, baby. He pulled the win out for us. Nice game, man. My boy saw that coming. Oh, what the fuck? You landed on those, those knives, baby. Oh, what the fuck? I thought he was on my team. I was like, what the fuck? I thought my teammate got knocked out. <laughs> oh my god, that sucks. That sucks. Oh, how the fuck? wreck now when the screen when the screen does that Can my ninja move? Oh my god. Oh <laughs> I can't even tell, man. It's like so close. Woo! And I'm 
kind of upset. I'm kind of upset about that, to be honest, because that was my first time ever playing Resident Evil 3. Even if it was a remake or a reimagining, that was my first time ever really diving into a Resident Evil 3. So that was supposed to be like special. And I didn't, it didn't, or I forgot to save it. Like I had so many little projects that I needed to edit. It just got out, it just got, it just got like, it went over my head. Where I was like, I forgot that I was about to get deleted. Cause um, Twitch actually starts to delete the, the VODs if you don't save them. Or you don't download them. Or if you don't save them or download them, then it deletes it like in a, a couple weeks, I think. And I forgot. I was like, oh, I got enough time. Because I was editing um, Resident Evil 1, I was editing Resident Evil 0, and I was editing Resident Evil 2. So I was like, I got time to get Resident Evil 3, and I just fucking forgot. And I got on here, and it was gone. I was like, oh my god. I was mad. It was my fault, though. Hmm. So have you never played the original Smash Brothers, Johnny? Or you don't got no homeboys or homegirls or family members that play um, Smash Brothers with you? What's up? Yeah, y'all yeah, should just go back to 1v1, man. I would. Should I change the room to 1v1? What do y'all think? In the past, it used to be, it used to stay on there. For, <clears throat> on the past, in the past, like I say, like maybe two or three years ago, now, it used to save automatically and you just had to delete it. But now it doesn't matter. You know what I mean? This like some um some Safeway brand or something. Signature Select. It's cheap ice cream, but I like it. And it's chocolate mousse. It's chocolate with more chocolate, baby. Y'all think I'll be playing though, huh? Y'all think I'll be playing, man. I'm just like If you got chocolate around me, you better hide that shit. You better hide that shit. You get knocked out. Yeah. At least it came down to the wire, huh? Josh versus his boy Alex. Good games though. Um, have a good, have a good, nice fellas. Final destination completion. Oh, you want final destination? All right. Thanks for coming through, though, Ken. Oh, it was a pleasure to meet or see you in game and action, man. Uh, like I said, make sure you link me. I'll, I'll hit you up again on Twitter so you can link me to your YouTube channel so the homies can know and people can know that are in the game if they want to get in. Or maybe you start streaming this yourself or you start uh, recording a little bit of matches, then it'll be all gravy. You want Final Destination? So I have to change it, right? I'm the one that has to change it. This is like Naruto versus Sasuke right here, because these fools are like are rivals. Ain't that right, Josh and Alex? <laughs> Catch you later, though, for show, man. For show. That's like the first time I got to play with um, the homie Ken, man. I'm telling y'all, man, y'all don't understand. The last time I seen him was back when he was still a pup, and I still didn't like. I didn't. I didn't. 
I still had the mentality like, okay, I'm not, I'm not, I don't really want to talk with people that are younger, um, verbally and stuff like that. If we play a game, you just happen to be in a match or you're in a group, that's fine. This man's a man now. It's been a long time. It's been a long time coming. So now he's finally. He, he asked me a few times back in the day too. Even when, even when this came out on the Switch, I just was like, "Oh, I don't play Smash anymore. I'll haul at you when I do." And he asked me again, and I was like, "All right, I'm, I'm gonna stop being an ass and like I'm gonna put this game in because I put it in for the homies, man." It's not that I don't play Smash or I don't. I'm not good at it or anything like that. Cause I know I'm more, I'm, I know I'm more than decent, you know. Like I've been playing for a while. It's just, what the fuck was that? <laughs> it's just I have to be in the mood to play Smash Brothers. That's what I'm saying. After like five fucking generations of Smash, I gotta be in the mood to play Smash. The same thing with um. Like Call of Duty games. I play Call of Duty games forever, just like everybody else. When a new Call of Duty would drop every year, I buy it. I buy a new one. Uh, there's a new one, I buy that one too. I got tired of that shit, you know? It's the same way with like Splatoon. If Splatoon came out every fucking year, I wouldn't play Splatoon that much. I wouldn't play it. You know what I mean? I feel the same way for, um, I feel the same way for, like, Mario Kart as well. So that's why I was even more pissed when Mario Kart 8 Deluxe came out. I was like, I don't give a fuck about no Deluxe. I'm never buying that game on, I'm not buying that game full price. I'll buy that game on sale. Because I played the hell out of the, for, out of 8. I played that shit all the way to it, till it fucking went down with the hacks. I know what I'm saying. I mean, don't you guys have a favorite series, but you just get tired of it? Maybe it takes you a little bit longer to get tired of it if you don't have that many games. Oh, that butter sword, though. That butter sword, though. All right, I'm going to change the level. Final destination. Let's see if we go the destination. Sorry about that, Alex. See, I don't know how to. I don't know how to change it. I think I have to. Ch I think I have to back out and change some rules. That's what I said, like, when you play Call of Duty all the time, don't you get tired of Call of Duty? You get tired of Call of Duty, you know? You get tired of Mario Kart. You get tired of Smash Brothers. I mean, any game you play, like, if you just play it over and over and over, then a new system comes out and you just play the same game over and over and over. And especially if they're not making like a new series or these companies are getting lazy and they're not making anything new or um, refreshing. Like I need something to be refreshed. That's why I like to play a lot of indie games. I don't care if they're not AAA titles. I don't care if they're not that long. I like playing different stuff. And if I can get my hands on it, I'm going to fucking play it. It's Rainbow Road, baby. What? What you saying down for, uh, Inferno? What did I do? <laughs> he said that's a big ass version of uh, Ben and Jerry's. I mean, I'm not gonna eat the whole thing, you know. This thing will probably last me a good week because I, I don't eat I don't eat ice cream like that. I'm not depressed, damn it. I'm not depressed. <laughs> don't be hating on my ice cream inferno. I know you got some snacks over there too. Hmm. <laughs> 
damn. <laughs> uh, Johnny got some snacks. Inferno got some snacks. Right, I gotta put this back in the freezer. Anybody watching wants to jump in and try to challenge my boys and they got some decent internet. Josh here, he has a channel on YouTube as well. I don't know if Alex has one. I don't know. We got two DLC characters going at it though. I gotta see if these guys can hear me. I don't think they can hear me. So does anybody else in here actually play Smash? Like, or you guys don't like Smash either? Flash, um, I know Sash, I know Anish doesn't. Um, Inferno says he plays. My boy Nick didn't get to make it out because he had to work. So. He's usually somebody I try to invite in here too, because he's really good at this game as well. Always be beasting. Uh, my boy Josh always beasts. My boy Alex is pretty damn good too, so... I didn't really get to see Alex in, 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 um, in action until today, really. Because last, like I said before, it used to lag so fucking bad. Oh, he knows that trick. He waited for that shit. See, me, I, w I ran right into that and got bopped. Oh, shit. Oh, he had, the he had good spacing for that. Play Ultimate Sun. Nobody is ready for my Ice Climbers. Oh, my God. You would run some fucking get shit. It's going to be dusty as fuck over here, too, I bet you. Yep, it's dusty as fuck. <laughs> I don't know how to get so dusty. I'm kind of ashamed to show it because it's so dusty, but I'm going to show you anyway. I'm going to show you this dust bucket. Look at this shit. Where are my GameCube boys at, though? Remember people used to make fun of the handle? 
Like, why has he got a fucking handle? I'm like, yo, man, if you want to take this over the homie's house. I used to have this controller, but somebody, I think somebody stole it. So, I only got the black one, the orange one, and another black one. Is there anything in here? There's nothing in here. I bet you it still works, too. Yeah, if you're not using a GameCube controller for Smash, then you're fucking up. I'm sorry. I'm sorry to be the one to tell you. I got my PlayStation 2 over here too, but I'm not pulling that out. It's kind of it's still hooked up because I have Persona 3 in there. Persona 3 is on on deck, you know. My man really went to go switch icons. Wait, what did he do? <laughs> what did he do? <laughs> you like Super Mario Sunshine? Ugh. I mean, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't not, I didn't dislike it, but I didn't like it. I didn't like it either. You know what I mean? I just remember getting this crazy ass headache when I would hear that Delfano Square music. When I would hear that shit, it's in this game too. When I would hear the music on that level all the time, I used to get this crazy headache. And I have no, I have no clue if it was just for that time period or... I have no clue if it was just for that time period or what. Well, I guess that's a game you're going to be getting if they actually do remake it, because there's rumors about the HD version coming out for Super, um, for Sunshine, as well as 64. All I want is 64. That's all I want. I don't care about Galaxy, but you know what? I think I might, I think I might, like, I think I might support Nintendo for Galaxy, because I never played Galaxy. You know? And then at the same time, I never bought, um, I never bought Super Mario 3D World as well. 3D World or, um, any of those games, actually, because I just rented them, I just rented them back in the day. I was like, this is way easier than buying it. I was like, I don't have money to spend it on this shit at the time. I was trying to fuck, I was trying to, like, fix up my car and stuff. It was a lot of stuff going on. I was like, fuck, man, I can't do both, you know what I mean? But now, if the game comes out, I'll probably buy it. But at the same time, they don't put Pinkman 3 out. There's no Pinkman 3. There's no, um... There's no Mario, um... Paper Mario HD. Give me, like, Thousand Year Old Door HD, man. Because I never got to play that one. Ooh. I never got to play that one. That's that's definitely one I wanted. Oh, I like how, I like how this fool's jacket hangs off his back with the sleeves out. I just now noticed that. I just now noticed that. That's pretty sick. They did the 64 DS, alright? They put, like, Yoshi in there and shit, right? Wasn't Yoshi a playable character? Peach was, too. Like, everybody was playable, I remember. I never had it. I never owned it, but... So, what's, what's you guys' Okay, since we're talking about GameCube, what's you guys' first GameCube game out that you ever played or owned? Johnny, Clash, Inferno? Anybody else that has a GameCube that's in the chat? Whoa. This seems like a pretty close match, but um my boy Alex be putting in work with that fucking that 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 forward B move, man. Let's see, what if he post last? I had some animation on here. Bro holla, baby. Yeah man, please start streaming again. You guys want to go check out, um, Ken shit? Please do. His name is Kendall, but he said it can call him Ken. Yeah, he was back, he was around when I was playing, um, GoldenEye 007 on the Wii. Because I was playing, um, I was playing Legends as well, but that game was, like, not the same as... The Wii, the Wii version. 
But I was excited. I was like, yo, they're putting double, they're putting Goldeneye on the fucking online. You know how many people... If you grew up with an N64 and you didn't have Goldeneye or Perfect Dark, you're fucking fired. Oh, he sniped him. Whoa. That's a crazy-ass move, man. That shit breaks shields every time or what? You still, you still speak to Soto? Yeah, Soto's like a childhood friend, man. He's always around. He just doesn't game as much because he got, he got into a relationship, I think. He got into like a, uh, a relationship, so now he's not around as much. And I don't mess with him. I let him do his thing because I think he was missing out all this time. I, I officially feel like that was his first official girlfriend. And I've known this fool since childhood. Then my other boy, um, New World Gamer, got married. And I, I that's, that's that speaks for itself. He got married. He has a family. He has like a couple kids now. So I don't really mess. I don't really try to mess with them. Like I, I'll talk to them on the holidays or their birthdays and stuff. But it kind of got to that point to where like they're not like around as much. So I'm like, all right, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna fuck with them. But I went to my boy's wedding. I went to my boy's wedding. That's such a pretty move, man. I like that. Wait, he has a dunk move? Crazy. Trader. <laughs> I remember him from YouTube like for Yeah, he was he was in our um he was in our um our Avatar golf Avatar um golf games, right? You were there too for like once. You were there one time when I was streaming and he was around. I'm gonna get him to get like Xbox Live again and we're gonna play the fucking Avatar golf. I don't care if it's just for like a couple of months, we're gonna fucking play it. That shit was too much fun. You guys don't know, man. Like, little simple shit like golf. Like, golf and tennis. And those kind of games online were fucking amazing on a 360. Amazing. I met some funny characters on that. Pip's up. I knew Pip was going to be up, man. So, Sesh said that we should watch the anime stuff tomorrow, man. Because you were asleep. So I was like, alright, tomorrow. Probably watch it early then. We can we can watch it like earlier in the day. This way, um Inferno, you hear this man? Well I don't know. They I let these guys decide because like I said, they're the ones that kinda really wanted to do it. It's not really my idea. I wouldn't mind it, but I was just like, I don't know if people are up for that. That's why you don't see me having as much input, because I'm not the I mean I'll I'll host it, no problem, but it's only on Discord. N64, um, Jet Force Gemini? Wait, what was that? That sounds familiar. Jet Force Gemini. I feel like a lot of people skip over these consoles. Let's see what the hell this game was about. Oh, is that a shooting game? Oh, that looks hella familiar. Hold on. Oh, I think my I think one of the homies had this game. Banjo, man, strama no much get tower for sure. You know, I said it. Okay. No, it was Smash Brothers. It was Smash Brothers, and then and then I got Double Dash, and I thought I was gonna relive. Um, well. When I was playing Melee, man, that, that was such like a refreshing game. It was like so refreshing, you know? It's like, oh shit, Mario or Smash Brothers not on fucking a bullshit TV. I mean, we still were playing like on, you know, standard definition and shit like that, but it just felt like it was above its time at the time. It felt like it wasn't even, it felt like we were playing in HD even though we weren't, you know? It felt fluid as fuck. Do or Kai? Do or Kai? Am I saying the Kai part right? He always laughs at me because I never say his name right. Even if he tells me how to say it, I never say it right. It's kind of a running joke. On his Twitter, it says his name was Ken, so I was just like... I never asked him what his name was. I know this fool's been around for ages. 
Switch Super Mario Odyssey? Yeah. You have to put some respect on Odyssey, you know? I feel like Odyssey 2 is going to be coming out. What do you guys think? Odyssey 2? New Super Mario Bros. U online. Multiplayer, no lag. Dedicated servers. <laughs> Keep dreaming. Keep dreaming. See, that's why I don't understand. When Nintendo re-releases a game that was on like the, on the on the Wii or the Wii U, and they don't add no online, but they make you pay for online now. So it's just like, are you not confident in your own servers? Are you not confident in your own developers that you can put this game online for people to actually have a good internet? People to actually, you know? We shouldn't be going through this and this we shouldn't be going through this right now. Like it's like it's too late in the in the gaming world to be dealing with nonsense. There's some crazy ass internet speeds out there. You get business speed, baby. You get that business that business um that business class. And you don't lag like that. If you keep your you keep your TV on point, you keep your monitor on point for the low input lag and shit like that, and the processing and all that, then you're on point. But a lot of people don't know. And Nintendo, like I said, Nintendo, Nintendo's been basically a joke to me when it comes down to their online because they don't even, they don't even build the, imp they don't even build the adapter into the fucking system. You have to buy an extra piece, and most people don't even know what the hell that is. And most people just, like I said, most people are just happy to be online. You understand? They get the console, they're like, oh, how do you hook this shit up to, to the internet? And they're like, oh, Wi-Fi. And they think their Wi-Fi is on point. They think their Wi-Fi is so good. Most, some people's is, some people's isn't, like, you know? But some people think that shit's too good. And it's like, in reality, it's trash. And um, that's probably why you're lagging your ass off, you know? And I ain't gonna say I wasn't there before, but you know what? It didn't take me that long. Oh, shit, he pulled it out. It didn't take me that long to figure out what the problem was, you know what I mean? Like, I'm not gonna blame everybody else for right in here. Or maybe they're watching in the background. But uh, we used to play that shit all the time, and we used to go to tournaments, and um... I didn't win any, my fr- oh, wait, wait, no. I won one at my mall, I won, I won one at a mall, on the grand opening, because I had a um... This is for Bra, by the way. And the funny part is they made us use the nunchucks, right? They made us use the nunchucks. And um, I was whooping that ass with Samus then, too. Of course, they had on all the fucking items and shit. And I was like, this makes it a little too easy for me. Some of these people don't know how to play. And there was, like, a couple people that were really good. And I was like, fuck, I gotta watch out for this guy. But um, Melee Days was um, pretty fun. Melee tournaments. I didn't win any Melee tournaments. I got, like, third or second in a, a couple of them. My friend won one of them when I was there. He beat me at the end. It was me and him. It was me versus him. I think it was Falco and he was on um, Peach. And I was like, I should have just went Ness. I don't know why I picked Falco versus her because he's such a lightweight. And I was getting fucked. And he was really good with Peach. But. Alright, what's going on here? Kai part is right. So it's do like Daru Darukai Darukai. Oh, there you go. Thanks for thanks for spelling out for for the lames. <laughs> Darukai. There you go. It's duh like doctor. Wait. It's duh like doctor. Darukai. Yeah. Okay. GGS. Um. I don't know if someone answered you, but Bale 2 was on the Switch. Oh, good. So dumb amount of BS you need to play with games with no lag. Literally pay to be in our own Wi-Fi and no servers. Nintendo's being greedy. I mean, there's... The, the, the thing is, like... Okay, how many... Like, you played on the 362, but... If you can compare, like, how the game... How the online feels for the... For the... The 360... Or anything else compared to the Wii, or anything any Nintendo console. Wouldn't you say? Wouldn't you say it feels way better? Like what you're playing, what you played on the 360 feels way better than something that's fucking newer than the fucking 360. The internet still sucks. Shit, I even feel like the Wii U had a good internet. It's just people, 
Yeah, the Wii U had some good connections. I mean, I feel like I feel like the Wii and the Switch are kind of the same in the connection department. Like nothing's really changed on the Switch. They didn't do anything different. Same net codes and shit, you know. The hell's going on in this room? <laughs> Game. Gadgets. That's what I don't like. So my PlayStation, my PlayStation's right here. You guys don't know this, but my PlayStation's right here on top of my um, my computer tower, right? It's right here on top of the computer tower. My Switch is over here, like right, close to my other my TV. And then I have the I have the Wii U. I have the Switch on top of the Wii U. Then the Wii is over here, like tucked in with the with the um, with the PlayStation 2. It's tucked in with the Wii. And it's tucked over there with the with the the 360. <laughs> and then my switch, my um 3DS is right here. My 3DS is right here. I already showed you guys this. Pip was here. Of course it's blue. What y'all thought? Y'all don't hate my blue my blue um 3DS, okay? You don't do that. It's not allowed. <laughs> yeah, see my boy Josh right here, aka the cloud user, aka uh, Nullis, Nullis, or Nullius, I can't say names. He's basically, he basically has a, he has a channel, but he doesn't stream as much. And he doesn't stream this, which is kind of weird, because I'm like, I think it lags for him when he plays this. So, like, I don't mind posting his games like this. Even back in the day, um, on the Wii U, um, Smash Brothers 4 would allow you to send your saved copies of your games to your friends. And I would tell these guys all the time, like, if you ever get any epic matches and you want me to record it in, like, you know, 720p or 1080p, or just post it on my channel so you can have a run back, I will do that. I'll actually make you your own folder, put all your matches in there for you. For you, since you can't record at the time. So I think that's what's cool about having a room where you can actually make a lobby and you know you can play with the homies. I ain't gonna lie, like this is playing pretty damn smooth compared to what happened when I first played with Alex. Cause like I said, he said he lives in Chile. He said he lives in Chile, and he's playing with my boy in um, in Canada. And look how the, look how the match looks. It doesn't. It looks smoother for me because I'm watching. I can see the little lag here and there, but they look like they're playing pretty fluently. You know. It looks good. It looks good. It plays good. Yeah. 3DS, baby. I ain't gonna lie. I kind of neglected my 3DS for everything else. I just got it for Hunter. I never wanted a 3DS. I was like, eh. Like my ex, my ex had a, my ex had a DS, and I used to play that shit a lot because I, like I said, I would play, I would play Cookie Mama on there. Actually, I told you guys this already, but I got her Cookie Mama, I got her Phoenix Wright, Ace Attorney. She had the Mario games on the 3DS, on the DS. I can't remember what else she had. I just know I got her like Did those I, shit in here. Playing some delicious games. He's playing some delicious games. Oh yeah, Persona, baby, let's go. This is the persona level they put in the game for people that, are, that do not know. Oh fuck. You guys hear this dog out here? There's a dog barking at like a fucking 1 a.m. I can hear him with the head, with, even with the earplugs, and I can hear this fucking dog. Pip was playing this delicioso game. Uh, I don't know. Have you ever streamed um, Animal Crossing, Pip? Or are you not really into that? I know you got the game, but I don't know if you love, I don't know if you like it as much as you thought you would. I have no clue. And then he was playing um, Octopath, which I gotta get to. He was playing Monster Hunter Generation. I think that was, that was his first Monster Hunter. And. Um, 
I'm trying to think what else he plays. Splatoon. Or what I've seen him stream, at least. And he plays a lot of PC stuff, too, actually. So, I can't keep up with all the PC stuff. Persona is Nintendo now? Oh, what the hell is this? Approved Eggnog. Egg no what? Was that a bot? <laughs> yeah, I, I felt it. I seen something about real viewers or some stupid shit, and I was about to say, thanks, Clash. Clash, <laughs> Clash took one glance at it, and he was like, cancel. <laughs> You're canceled. Boogie, baby. Boogie's in the house. <sighs> Little young Boogie, y'all. Y'all should check out Boogie, especially if you're young. If you're younger, and you guys want somebody around your age to check out, check out Boogie. He's pretty funny. And he be streaming. He was streaming Apex, and I think he plays like, War he plays Warzone as well. It's so like I said, if you're, if you're young or you're like a teenager, then uh, you should check out Boogie's channel. He comes around here every now and then, acting the fool. <laughs> How you doing tonight, man? Are you streaming? Have you been playing? What's good? Well, yeah, Johnny, uh, I was asking you, like, of all the games you played on, on the Xbox, like, would you say it lags as much as it lags on the Switch? I don't care what game you play. <laughs> that was a crazy-ass death. Boogie streaming now. There y'all go. How you liking that then? How you liking pals, man? Because we can get you in here. Wait, I don't know. If you're in Chile, though. Because I'm going to play pals soon because of the update. I know Clash has been running. You've been running Clash? What's going on, man? Tell me about some of the updates. Tell me about some OP shit so I know. Because I haven't been playing. I've been watching uh, my boy AV. He's been running. He looks like he's having a good time. A good stressful time. He's been playing rank. I think he's a grandmaster, or he's going for grandmaster as well. I'm surprised you're not in there talking to him when he's playing, because he's always looking for some people to play, Clash. And since you like that game a lot more than me, then I think you would have been in there. Unless you just like hanging with the Goonies, which is fine. But I think since he's playing with um, rank people, and that's your thing? You like to play rank? Unless you already got a group? Then be my guest, man. Go show go show the homie some love, you know? He's a cool guy. Yeah, I played a little bit. It was okay, I guess. Giving into the Dr. Pepper craving. Yeah, I've been sipping on my Snapple, baby. I need to get I need to get sponsored. Snapple, are you listening? <laughs> nah, I don't need to get sponsored, but. I'm giving that mango, that mango passion, baby. <sighs> I'm just sitting here talking while they're playing. I'm glad he got his homie in here, though, because I don't ever see Alex. I hope y'all know. Like, Alex is not around as much. But if I pop in Smash, then, um... Um... Um, you'll always see Josh show up, and you'll always, like, Josh always gets Alex to come in here if he's not busy. I gotta start, like, picking a good day to stream, like, if I'm gonna play Smash at all. I gotta get a good day when my homie Nick is in here, because I need my boy Nick in here to represent, too. Nick's a, Nick's a fucking beast at this game as well. I always talk about him, too. I remember, like, I remember, because when I met my boy Nick, I met him on the, on the, on the Wii as well. That's why I keep saying, Wii days were so fun for me. Like, there was just, like... Because you had to be social. Like, I, I, I became, like, anti-social a lot more over the years. With a lot of dumb shit. It's not because I don't like people. It's just... Well, that is kind of the thing. I don't like a lot of people because they're weird. And they do, they, they do dumb shit. <laughs> they do dumb shit. But... I feel like it was just like, okay, I'm good. I don't really need to... I've never been the guy that always had to be in the middle of anything. So even when I was streaming, like, even when I stream, I'm just like, I'm cool. Just with, like, a handful of you guys in here. You don't see me, like, trying to be like, hey, I need everybody in here trying to... I know that's not, like, how streamers are supposed to be, like, trying to build their channel. 
but it's not like it's not like a big thing to me. It's just like whoever's in here is in here. You know what I'm saying? If you find me, you find me. I'll never go to somebody else's channel and promote my channel. I'll never go and you know what I mean. I don't do. I, I just don't do that kind of stuff. I don't look for that kind of stuff. And I feel like they like people online promote that a lot. They tell you to do that, so that's why I think a lot of people do it. I mean, of course, you want people that play like games. You know what I mean? But I feel like if I go into somebody's chat and um, they're playing something that I play and I'm just watching them for a little bit, I'll never mention that I stream something. You know what I mean? Does that make sense to you guys? I'll never be like, oh, yeah. I'll be like, oh, I play that game, too. That's about it. I wouldn't be like, oh, yeah, when I play, this happens. I wouldn't be like, yeah, come to my channel. Come do this. Come do that. I just feel like it's automatic. If people want to, people are interested in you, they'll just come and check you out. But that might be a bad thing for a streamer, per se. Sipping on some scissors. <laughs> Thank you for the bits, Boogie Man. Boogie's too nice. Boogie, Boogie on down that road. <laughs> 